Welcome back, everybody, and Happy New Year. Now, typically, um, because of the oncoming weather, I might have worn a longer tie today because uh, usually I wear a bow tie when the weather's going to be really, really nice. I think we'll be okay through most of the day tomorrow, but as we get into tomorrow night, then we get into a little iffy sort of a situation. So, but I thought to start off the new year, why not put on one of those uh, bow ties? So here we take a look at the clouds and the radar now. I just checked outside and we do have a high thin overcast going on and most likely that's the way it'll stay through the nighttime tonight. So we'll go with partly cloudy tonight because I do believe you'll be able to see at least some stars through the clouds. Now, when we get back together at 10 and 11 uh, Indiana time, I may change that a little bit, so we'll see. Uh, 32 degrees right now after a high today of 35. Average high is 38, so we weren't too far off the mark and our low this morning of 20 is average. So. We're doing okay temperature wise, really. 34 degrees in Linton, Robinson 33, Vincennes 34, Olney 34, and Flora 35 degrees. Mattoon has 32, but a pretty good breeze going on out there. A southwest wind at nine miles per hour, 10 in Robinson, southwest in Vincennes at nine, and Paris nine, and Mattoon nine. No wind re being reported in Olney, and Bloomington has a 10 mile per hour breeze. So if you are out, you do have a wind chill factor to deal with. So the wind chill in Terre Haute's 24, Casey 26, Robinson 25, and Vincennes 27. So let's take a look at the Storm Team 10 future cast over the next 48 hours, and I think it'll pretty much spell out what we can expect. This is tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. and see how this uh, light little precipitation, I think this is noon tomorrow, I think this might be a little aggressive in bringing in some precipitation. Lindsay Monroe will go back about this tomorrow morning and of course I'll have an update later on tonight. And this is six o'clock tomorrow night. That might be a little more within the framework, but I think late tomorrow night, that's when we really have the very good chance of some freezing rain or sleet and or rain developing because of the temperature. See, here's three, four, five, six o'clock in the morning on Saturday, right in through here. So Saturday morning could be a bit uh, iffy, a little slick as far as travel early on Saturday morning. Then we switch over to all rain and then we taper off that to maybe some lingering flurries Saturday night into the first part of the day on Sunday. Partly cloudy, not quite as cold tonight, 24 for the overnight low. And then for tomorrow, partly sunny, a little bit warmer, a high tomorrow of 35. And uh, then for tomorrow, rain, sleet, freezing rain, developing late, 30 degrees for the overnight low. And then the seven day forecast, well, it's gonna be hard to get out, uh, away from the moisture and the frozen precip on Saturday, a wintry mix. And then it changes over to all rain, 90% chance of that and switches back to a sleet or snow on Saturday night into the first part of the day on Sunday and then cold all next week and a chance of snow on Tuesday. 